In this recorded demo, we show the integration of HPE Service Guard with VMware in an extended distance cluster. The integration is based on the dynamically linked storage capability, which has been available with Service Guard since version 12.0.40. A large number of customers today want to run their mission critical workloads virtualized due to the flexibility that virtualization provides. But at the same time, there is still a need today to protect these workloads in the best possible way. HPE Service Guard for Linux has provided the best high availability and disaster recovery capabilities in the industry for decades and it can be combined with the most popular virtualization platforms including VMware. With Service Guard, the recommended way to make the storage available in a VMware environment is through a technology we call Dynamically Linked Storage, or DLS. With DLS, we can use the storage as VMFS volumes, which allows us to use the most popular features of VMware, such as live migration through vMotion, Distributed Resource Scheduler, or DRS, and Site Recovery Manager, or SRM. At the same time, we get the best protection that Service Guard provides, including native VMware multipathing and fencing of the storage against unwanted access not coming from the active workload. As we will show in the demonstration, the storage is only accessible from the guest running the active workload. In this demonstration, we show an HPE Service Guard extended distance cluster. The cluster is built from guests running on VMware ESXi 6.5. In the cluster, we're running virtualized Oracle 12CR2 databases on top of Oracle data files using ASM storage. The ASM storage is built from VMFS volumes. The Oracle application is protected through a package which is defined using the service guard Oracle toolkit. All the storage is defined using dynamically linked storage and since this is an extended distance cluster running Oracle, Oracle ASM is used to mirror the data files between two different data stores which reside on two different sets of storage in two different sites.